here's a piece of me to chew on. Hi everyone, uh, I'm Peter Delving. Uh, I guess this is, this is the Peace of Mind blog or pod or whatever it is. Uh, welcome. Um, this is, you know, the, the first couple of episodes we're going to try to understand what the hell we're doing and, and what, what we're, we're aspiring for. Uh, yeah, so welcome. Previously, I've, I've, I've been writing and I've been creating, you know, music. Music was my, my main thing for many, many years. Um, and over the years, I, I came to the conclusion that uh, I wanted to do something else. Now, I'm not sure this is what that something else is, but I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure that uh, I'm not sure of anything. And I think that's what this pod is going to be about. Having traveled the world basically uninterrupted in, you know, the most case since I was a kid, which is now more than, more than 30 years, um, on a global you know, scale that that's that's privilege, and I think I want to I want to share some of those understandings and and some of the questions that it's brought you brought up in me, because this beautiful whole thing, which is our planet, which is our our perceptual mutual understanding, is not quite what we make it out to be. I want to talk about that. I, I want to point to the discrepancies. I want to point to the glitches because there are glitches. Uh, yeah, and a lot of them. <laughs> there are cracks in the surface. Um, but like I said, I don't think we should be afraid of that. I don't think we should fear that. I don't think we should fear chaos. I don't think that we should fear what we can't control. Um, I think we are better off in starting to look at what seems to be the real kind of thread of reality, so to speak. Uh, and that seems to be, you know, uh, everything but control. So I think that's one of the things that, that this pod is going to be about. And I think it's going to be about politics. And I hope that it'll be about sex. Uh, about self-understanding, hopefully about uh, awareness, consciousness, um, meditation. Uh, and what, why do I want to bring those things in? Because I, I don't know. I, I, I feel that in many, many ways, uh, media trivializes all those things. It kind of, kind of brings it into. Uh, uh, a format that just you know cuts every kind of serious level by down by the feet you know and 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 that's that's kind of sad instead we get stereotypes we get these grandiose narcissists who are perfect for a studio format and a kind of discussion that is very limited um, I, I suppose, I, I don't know, I, I can't say that I suppose because that's, that would be a lie, but I, it looks as if there's a, a need for it or a, a hunger for that. You know, people love their Oprah and they, they love their, their, you know, their Ellen DeGeneres or their, their Billy Grahams or their whatever. Um, but it's not very punk rock and it's not very, it's not very Osho, is it? It's not very... Uh, it's not very spiritual, um, and it's incredibly rigid. <laughs> and I, I hope that we can move away from that with this. Uh, we'll try. I think more than anything, this pod will be kind of about chaos, uh, about you know the preconceived notion of what what chaos is uh, in regards of anything you know in in reality we have so many you know preconceived notions about order being peace and being harmony about uh, repetitive constructions about doing the same thing over and over again about uh, 
finding some kind of, I guess, emotional uh, equivalent of, of what we believe peace or harmony to be. Um, but order is usually, you know, it, it, various forms of violence. Um, you know, it's, it's, so it's not, it's not, it's not as we perceive it. It's actually kind of the other way around. It's, it's become inverted, where control comes out of fear. And fear, it's a drive. It, it pushes people to try to make things their way. Um, and when you do that, uh, you take away other people's freedom. You take away the freedom of other entities. You take away the freedom of, of other elements in this, you know, perceptual bubble that is this reality that we share. Um, and if anything, we we can we can try with this pod anyway to to kind of uh, shake your mind a little bit to to hopefully see a little bit more of what that is because you know this is today with quant physics and, and so many people starting to actually understand the construct of all this and not feeling fearful of it. Uh, it's, 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 it's more of an international movement you know, than it has been since the 60s, which is very, very cool. So I think that's what we're, we're gonna try to do with this here. So I, I woke up this morning knowing that we we're going to start doing this. This is the, the, the first, first day we're doing this. And, and I woke up and I, I had this, this thought that um, it's important for me to keep reminding myself uh, of what's here and now, uh, every day. And to not fall into um, the trap of the past. For me, I have I have personally to deal with a lot of a lot of like it's like like you have you have scars you, you get you know you get scars you get you cut yourself but mentally we get scars as well so personally I have uh, I have something called a clinical depression uh, and I have something called PTSD and these are like mental scars uh, that have come from exposure to uh, painful things um, and what I've found by in my entire life through through all the experiences i've had i've addressed um this as if it was something that i could actually address if it's something that i could deal with uh how could i how can i meet my own emotions how can i receive myself if there's no other person there to talk to um uh, if there's no therapist there, if it's, there's, there's no best friend there, if there's no, no lover there, who, who can I turn to? Well, I have to turn to myself because I have to be my own therapist. I have to be my own best friend. I have to be my own lover. I have to be the one who loves me. Uh, and I think that's incredibly important to, to, to remember. And I want to try to remind you who have come you know, made the choice to, to, to watch this thing that, that, that we're doing, me and John. And that's, I think that's the most important thing with all of this, to, to remind you that, that, you know, you and I and all of us, we are, we're, we're worth loving, we're, we're worth caring for, we are beautiful, we're meaningful, we're, we're here, you know, we're actually, uh, you know, perceiving and, and, and taking part in this right now. And that in itself is, is nearly, well, not even nearly, it is a magical happening in itself. It's, it's, it's magic happening every, every time that, that, that I, you, we uh, actually give that, that, that acknowledgement to that source, that light, that love. And I, I, that's probably my, my highest aspiration for all of any of this 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 might sound a little bit pretentious to someone who's who's still caught you know in 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 fear uh well, that's okay you know you can be fearful you can be angry and you can be full of full of rage i know i am you know sometimes we we all are uh, but it's good to remind ourselves that anger 
and fear are always, always, always just distractions. They're, they're, they're um, the mind trying to remove itself from whatever it is that hurts. Uh, it, it's us trying to, you know, shift focus, to shift attention, uh, to run away from reality. Uh, and that's, that's something that's hard, you know, to, to come back to what is real. Yeah, but what is real? So I, I, I guess this is, this is the first uh, episode, or whatever we're going to call it. Um, please like uh, and, and press all the little buttons. And if you have any comments, write them down in the, the, the field. Um, communicate with us, you know. Uh, we, we really want to communicate. You know, if you have questions or ideas that think, you know, things that you want us to talk about, let us know and we'll, we'll bring them up and we'll, we'll communicate it with you. Um, Spread it to your friends if you like it. Uh, yeah, help us out and support us. So, take care. And, uh, Alak Baba Sirishan Dirak. Cause you are.